Hi friends. Welcome back to yet another video. In this video, I am going to show you, is it possible to enable all power plan in modern standby supported Windows 10 and 11. If you are using a modern computer and if you found that the only available power plan on the computer usually have balanced power plan by default and also you can create a custom power plan, whereas other power schemes are unavailable or hidden. Unfortunately, with the new Windows 10 version, 2004 update tradition sleep mode is not working. Also the reason behind this issue is that modern PCs use a new power efficient technology, known as S0 Low Power Standby, or Modern Standby. Windows Modern Standby S0 replaces the classic S3 Lower Power Mode in Windows 10 and 11. On a modern standby compatible system, the feature adds better power management for connected devices. Modern Standby S0 is a newer sleep state and a successor to the legacy sleep standby S3 mode. It replaces the standard sleep feature and puts your laptop in a lower power state when idle. How to check your system's current sleep state? Go to the search bar. Type CMD in the search box. Now select command prompt at the top of the result. Right click on it. And then choose run as administrator. Accept the user account control by clicking on yes button. Inside the command prompt, type the following commands to get the information about your system's available sleep state. Power CFG slash A. And then hit enter. Note, if you see standby, S0 lower power idle, network connected or disconnected, you have enabled modern standby. Then, you can check standby S3 status. If it reports, this standby state is disabled when S0 low power idle is supported. And also, if you see that, the system firmware does not support this S3 standby state, you can go to BIOS to see if the S3 state can be enabled in your system. It is not possible to disable modern standby and enable S3 standby mode in every BIOS firmware, whereas some BIOS firmware allow to disable modern standby. Enabling S3 standby in BIOS firmware can vary depending on your computer manufacturer and the specific BIOS version you have installed. When the hardware supports this modern standby mode, the motherboard firmware may exclusively stick to that mode, and prevent other power modes from being reported to the OS. That is not a bug, it is by design. If you need to use other power plans in Windows 10, you need to reconfigure the firmware of your device motherboard. Making any changes to your computer's BIOS configuration can potentially cause your system to crash. Therefore, it is recommended that you consult your computer's manual or contact the manufacturer's support team for assistance before making any modifications. However, after reading so many article and document, some people may still find certain methods helpful in specific situations. These methods are also effective for systems that support S3 standby, but unfortunately unable to show all power plans. You can manually modify the registry entry to disable modern standby. Press Window plus R to open the Run dialog. Type Regedit and hit Enter to open Registry Editor. Accept the user account control by clicking on Yes button. In order to navigate to the HKUI underscore local underscore machine backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash power key. Copy and paste the following location into the navigation bar and hit enter. Right click on the power sub key and select new at dword value, 32 bit. Now right click on the new value and rename it as platform AOAC override. Right click on platform AOAC override and select modify. Change value data into zero and hit OK. Now exit registry editor. 
Restart Windows to apply the change. After the computer has been restarted, to confirm the changes, execute the power CFG slash a command in an elevated command prompt. If this issue still persists, try next method. Go to the search bar. Type command prompt in the search box. Now select command prompt at the top of the result. Right click on it and then choose Run as Administrator. Accept the user account control by clicking on Yes button. Inside the command prompt, type the following commands to turn off Modern Standby. These commands are given in video description box. And then hit Enter. If you want to delete Platform AOAC Override Registry Entry Back, the procedure to delete platform AOAC override is given in the video description box you can check it. Restart Windows to apply the change. Once you have restarted the computer, verify whether modern standby has been turned off by running power CFG slash a command. Another easy way to disable modern standby is by using registry script. Go to the search bar. Type notepad in the search box. Now click to open notepad from the top of the result. Copy and paste the following content to the notepad file. And then click on file to choose save as. Enter the file name as disable underscore modern underscore standby dot reg. Click on save button. Now double click on the disable underscore modern underscore standby dot reg file and hit yes if prompted by UAC. Click on yes button to avoid this warning message. Now, the keys and values have been successfully added to the registry. Again, click on OK button. If you need to re-enable Modern Standby back, the procedure to re-enable Modern Standby is given in the video description box you can check it. Restart Windows to apply the change. Please subscribe this channel, like and share this video.